Hello, dear fellow. May I ask your name? I am Sir Napoleon. But it's the 1980s now. How can this be possible? Well, I time traveled to find out what the future would be like. Okay, then. A fairly recent discovery is balancing equations, so I must enlighten you. Wow, how random. But at least I'm learning of the future. Now what is this equation balancing? Well, this equation balancing is fundamental to the science of chemistry, as is solving a system of linear equations in algebra. What do mathematics have to do with science? Because equation balancing and equations are linked. All in all, a method in chemistry to balance chemical reactions. Done single quote interrupt sir. Oh, sorry. But how are they linked? It's fairly simple and can be accomplished by using basic problem solving skills. Like my fantastic battle strategies. Eh? Well, first you determine formulas for all reactants and resulting products in the reaction. Hmm. Then, you write the formula, putting reactants on one side of an arrow, pointing to the other side, the products. If there are more than one reactants or products involved, separate them with addition signs, so they come together. Oh, you divide the reaction with the compounds before and after the reaction? Indeed. Third, you must count the number of elements and compounds for both reactants and products. The lyotomic ions that are the same on both sides of the equation are seen as the same. Thus, the next step is balancing itself. That's only the beginning. Then, you balance elements by coefficients, a number that tells how many of the compound there are. Wait. Does that mean, if there are no coefficients, it is only one? Not zero. Good man, you're catching on. But don't attempt to change the numbers in subscript in a compound. I wouldn't dream of it. That would ruin the fun of balancing. When you're done making the reactants and products share the same mass and amount of elements each, make sure the coefficients are at their lowest possible ratio. Just so we don't complicate things and confuse people. It's easy math. Very good, Napoleon. Now you can teach this to the people in your time. <laughs>